Hey guys, Kings on the Fanboy here, and welcome back to another video. We have some interesting news regarding Diamondback today and some of the renovations that it's getting. So I personally have been keeping an eye on Diamondback for quite a while. I saw some cranes around the ride. On um, the chain return, there was some work being happening on that uh, with a crane up by the chain return. And I was wondering what was happening with that. There was some, I assume, metal plates on the ground under the lift hill. So there was a lot of stuff happening around Diamondback, and I was keeping a very close eye on it to see what would happen. But we finally got a little bit of answers. So from this first picture from heightened imagery, we can actually see inside of the chain troughs, and we can see that there is actually no chain inside of it. So what I think is definitely probably happening here is Diamondback's getting a new chain. There's no reason that the chain should be gone. They don't remove the chain every year and put it back in. They just keep it in there. They test it, of course but it always stays on the ride. So now that we know the chain's gone, we can pretty much assume that it is getting a new chain. So in this picture, we can also see down by the trailers and trucks that there are some crates on there. And I think it's pretty safe to assume that those crates either contain uh, the old chain or the new chain that they're installing on Diamondback. Uh, and with this theory kind of confirmed a little bit more with how we, they were working on the chain return, I think that with them working on on the chain return that um, it was they're trying to get either the chain out or get it not stuck on some things or they're trying to support the chain return a little bit more so by adding some more supports from the chain return to the bottom of the track. Now Diamondback has been running on the same train for 13 years at this point so I think it was just time for the ride to get a new chain and I think it's nice that Kings Island is investing in this ride. It is their one of their biggest draws for the park. It constantly gets consistent lines. It's a big people uh, getter for the park. It really a lot of people and guests that come to the park really enjoy Diamondback. So it's nice that Kings Island's focusing on that ride and other rides around the park. Well, that's all for this video. And who are you guys think down in the comments below? Do you have your own theories about what Kings Island could be doing to Diamondback? Or what do you think down all about this in the comments below? Do you like that they're getting, do you like it's getting a new chain? Do you have any comments about it? I want to hear all that down in the comments below. Again, well, that's all for this video. I want to thank you all for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.